something. Oh my gosh, it gets worse. Absolutely nobody in here. We moved chairs out of all the classrooms. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna be showing you guys what my last week of school looks like. I'm currently editing the video, but I never really made an intro. So here's the intro, but let's go all the way back to Monday. This week is our last week of school, finally. School year's almost over, but it's Monday and I'm currently making myself breakfast before I have to go to school. It is 8.48, which is really late. But that's the plan. Like, I didn't want to get to school that early because I didn't want to wake up early. But Allison's not going to school today because she's still recovering from her wisdom teeth surgery. Made myself a bagel. And uh, instead of skipping all day, I'm going for part of the day. I'm only skipping my first two periods because I know I'm not doing anything in those classes. The main reason I'm going to school today is because I have two projects in my last two periods. So I have to go. Other than that, I'm pretty sure I'm not doing anything in any other class. But today we have school like every period all day. And then tomorrow we have school all day, but we have our sixth period exam and then no seventh period. And then for Tuesday, no, not Tuesday. For Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, we have only two exams per day and then we get to go home. So we get to school around 9.30. You take two exams and go home at like one, which I actually like that schedule because I like not having to wake up early and then getting out earlier. And for most of my classes, well not most, but like a couple of them I already took EOCs for, so I don't actually have like a final exam. Got all my vitamins. I know in English I have a final exam, but it's gonna be so easy and we get to write like a bunch of stuff on one side of a piece of paper and use it for the test. And then for math, we had our EOC already. So we're flying kites. But yeah, I still have to go because she's counting it as a grade if I'm there. Spanish, we have an exam, but we get to write stuff on like a flashcard and use it. So that shouldn't be too hard. Fourth period, I have AVID. Our final exam was this like teen capsule that we're gonna open our senior year. Vet, I have a review, but it's gonna be super easy. Sixth period bio, I already took my EOC too. I don't know what our final exam is gonna be. You keep saying it's gonna be something, or I think it's gonna be something, but I'm honestly not sure. But right now we're doing a project that's due the day of the exam, so I'm guessing that's our final. And then history, I have a final, and that's the one I'm most worried about. I have an 87 question review. I'm halfway done with it. But that's the one I'm probably gonna fail. Once I'm done eating breakfast, I also need to pack my lunch, and then I'll be ready to go. Which I'm running a little late. I was planning on getting there, like in the passing time from second to third period, but I'm probably just gonna be late to third period, but it doesn't matter. Here's my breakfast. So now I'm gonna eat it and then I'll be back. Okay, I just finished eating my breakfast and now I need to pack my lunch. Today I'm gonna pack this protein bar and some pistachios. These pistachios are so good, guys. And guys, I have tryouts after school today. It's our group tryouts. They're from 7.30 to 9. So that's gonna be fun. And then I also have tryouts on Wednesday. And then we leave on Sunday for vacation. So I have to start like packing and all that. I've been like taking stuff out of my backpack because it's so heavy and I don't need all those notebooks and stuff anymore. So I've been like slowly taking stuff out. I think I'm going to head off to school. Here's the fit for today. Fake Burks, leggings, Amazon. This shirt is from this little store by the beach, but it's simply Southern. There's the back. And then my hair is a mess, um, but I don't really feel like doing anything in it. And quite frankly, I don't really care how I look at school anymore. So I just throw stuff on and just go. It's whatever. Who am I trying to look good for? Nobody. But that is it, guys. I will see you guys after school. Hey, guys. I am back from school. I just got home, and the UV is 9. It was 10 not too long ago, but I was stuck at school, so... But it's nine, which is still pretty good. So I'm gonna go outside and tan. The thing is, I'm mainly gonna tan my front because my back, I have tape on it. I have this back tape because my back's been hurting when I tumble, so I put that on it for tryouts. So I don't wanna tan my back too much because I don't wanna get tan lines from that. Allison just ordered this like after sun lotion type thing, and it came the other day. So I'm gonna use it after I'm done tanning, after sun body butter because apparently it's really good it smells pretty good it smells very it smells like vacation don't know how to describe that but i'll use this after 
Okay, got my bathing suit on, and now I need to put sunscreen on, which I use this like sunscreen and then this tanning oil. And then once I'm done with this, I'm gonna fill up my water bottle and head out there. Okay guys, I finished tanning and I took a quick little shower because I was dripping sweat. That's the worst thing about tanning. It's just like, I feel so nasty after, especially like at my house. Cause I feel like anywhere else, I just like go in the water and stuff. But I don't really wanna go in our pool and like have to wash my hair and all that. But I get so nasty and sweaty. So we took a quick little shower. And then also I made myself some food because I was starving. I had some rice with ropa vieja. And then I also put on the little after sun body lotion thing. It smells so good. But now I'm going to start editing my video. This is a what I eat in a day. That video is probably already out. So you guys should go check it out if you haven't. But luckily I don't have like that I know of any homework. So that's good. So I'm just gonna edit and then chill out until my tryouts because I leave for my tryouts at like 6.30. Even though I'm already dressed for them. I have my black sports bra on, gray Nike Pros, and then Hottie Hots over. But guys, look at the tan lines. They're so good. You can't tell me they aren't good. Hey guys, I just got home from a tryout and I also just finished eating dinner. I had a burrito, it was good and I'm so full. But let me tell you guys how tryouts went. We stunted most of the time, but it wasn't like a lot of stunting. It was just like the fundamentals. We literally just did preps. It wasn't much. But they split you up into groups and you're able to figure out what group you're in, like what group is what team. And I was in Gunsmoke's group and let's hope it stays that way. In the last like 10 minutes we tumbled. I did a layout, whipped through the layout and whip through to full. So it wasn't horrible, but I'm like 99% sure I didn't have homework. But if I did, that sucks because I didn't do it. I do need to turn in some stuff tomorrow. I don't, what am I gonna wear to school tomorrow? It's currently like 10 o'clock. I'm actually really tired, surprisingly. Oh, but also tomorrow is our last like lunch. Cause the last like three days of school, we don't have lunch. Cause we're only there for like four hours. Well, for the schedule, the school opens at the regular time for like kids who go on the bus or whatever. And then there's brunch and that's when you eat. No, really? Anyways. And then you go to your first period and that's like your study hall. And then you go to your actual testing classes, but they don't take attendance until your first testing class. So you can either go or not. And I'm definitely not. But anyways, I'm gonna get my pajamas to shower and then I'm gonna put my laundry away and go to bed. Good morning guys. It's 7.30 right now, which is kind of late because I didn't skip my first period, but it's okay guys. I'm not missing anything, but I do need to go to my second period because I have to turn something in. My teeth hurt so bad because I changed my Invisalign last night and now they hurt really bad. And don't mind my hair, it's kind of a mess from the ponytail from cheer last night. I haven't done anything in it. I literally took the ponytail out and that's it. I was like, I'm dealing with that tomorrow morning. But now it's the next morning and I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair. For makeup, the last couple of weeks, all I do is put some highlighter on, some concealer, and curl my lashes. Also some chapstick, cause my lips have been kind of chapped. Tonight, me and my dad might go watch this new movie that just came out. It's called If. It's about like imaginary friends, but it looks like pretty good. So we might go watch it. Okay, my lashes just do not want to curl today. It's gonna be kind of awkward getting to school late again because yesterday when I got there late, they were like, do you have a doctor's note or anything? It's like, no. They're like, so you're just coming late? I was like, yeah. And then we're coming late again, but it's whatever. They probably know a bunch of kids are just skipping school right now. And apparently yesterday, my first period teacher marked me present, even though I wasn't even there. Let's hope she marks me present again today. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is deal with my hair. I just kind of sprayed some water in my hair and put a bit of oil, but now I'm making myself some breakfast. We're toasting a bagel. I got all my vitamins. I have to leave the house in like 20 minutes. So I'm doing pretty good on time. Okay, my breakfast is all ready. And I'm gonna eat this and I'll be back so I can pack my lunch. I pack pretty much the same lunch every day. Nothing special. Let me do a quick little fit check. Got Big Burke's leggings, this shirt from Hollister. 
I'm pretty sure. Hey guys, I'm back home from school and I got picked up early because we had six period exams today and my six period teacher is literally not even here. We have a sub. So I'm like, there's no point in me going. So I left and the UV is 10. So I'm about to go outside and tan. But my bathing suits came from Bright Swimwear. Here's the top. It fits, but then the bottoms are way too big, sadly. The top's cute, but it looks kind of bad with the tan lines I already have. And then I also got it in this little design. Cute. I'm about to try this one on. Okay, here's the second top. Super cute. Okay, I changed back into the pink one, and I'm going to go out in tan. And I might go swimming, depending how cold the pool is after I tan. Guys, before I go tan, I think I'm going to take off the tape on my back because I want to be able to tan my back without worrying about getting tan lines from this. Oh, I have tryouts tomorrow and those are like my last tryouts and I was going to keep these on until tomorrow so that my back doesn't hurt. Ow. Ow. It hurts really bad. Holy crap, bro. Okay, I almost got them all off. Ah, got it. Finally off. Guys, the pool actually feels so nice because I was sweating. But let's check the tan lines. They're okay, they're pretty good. Since I've last talked to you guys, I've just been on my phone and then I fell asleep because I was really, really tired. And it's now around five o'clock and I just woke up from my nap. But that means we need to leave for the movie in like an hour and a half. So I'm gonna start getting ready for that. And then after the movies, me and my dad, we're gonna go eat dinner at Chili's. Chili's has been like trending on TikTok because apparently like their mozzarella sticks are like really, really good. So we're gonna go have that after the movie. Okay, I think I'm gonna wear these gray shorts and then this hoodie. So we're going to shower and then put this on. And then tonight I should probably study for my test that I have tomorrow. I have Spanish and history. Spanish one, I'm fine. But history is the one I actually need to study for. And we got an 87 question review, which I did it because it's a grade. But have I looked at it since I finished it? No. So I should probably study that a bit tonight. Okay guys, I'm done showering. For shoes, I'm just gonna wear my slippers because I love my slippers. Okay guys, it's time to go to the movies. We're bringing our little popcorn bucket and it was just gonna be me and my dad, but now Allison's coming with us. Guys, we made it. To the theater. I got my Slurpee and we got some popcorn. <laughs> We're like 20 minutes early though, and there's really? absolutely nobody in here. And let's hope it stays this way. We just finished the movie. It was good. It was a little boring at first, but then the end was good. I cried in the end. Oh. Me too. And during oh. that hospital scene, oh my gosh, I cried. We made it to Chili's. And I'm starving. Guys, we got our first order. We ordered two of these, one with egg rolls and one with alitas. Those look interesting. So we're gonna start taste testing because we're starving. Okay, we're gonna try the egg rolls first because what? they're what I'm most scared of. Uh, it looks questionable. You like, I like it? it? Yeah. It's actually good. <laughs> oh, these are the famous. This is what kind of is going trending all over TikTok because it has a good cheese pull. So let's. Let's test that out. <gasps> the cheese bowl. Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. That was good. And then we got a little hamburger slider. Pretty good. Mm. This is a pretty good dish. But now we're waiting for the alitas. Okay guys, the alitas are finally here. We just finished the first plate and the next one came. So perfect timing. This is what they look like. They're like kind of orange-ish, but they're buffalo. So let's see. <laughs> they're hot. Ooh, those are spicy. The like steam just went in my nose and like burned my nostril. They're okay. I expected better, but they're kind of spicy. 
Hey guys, it is the next morning. It's now Wednesday and it's currently 8.44, which means we gotta leave. We actually don't have to leave that soon, but anyways, we're not allowed to bring backpacks, but I still need to bring some stuff for my exams. So this is what I'm bringing. I have a pencil, obviously. And then for my Spanish exam, he let us write anything we want down on a little flash card and then we can use it during the exam. So we have this and then I have my history review and I also put my AirPods on my lanyard and I also put some gum in here. Guys, it does not feel like the last week of school. I was thinking about that last night before I went to bed. Like it does not feel like the last day. Oh, speaking of last night, I have no idea if I like filmed after Chili's last night because I don't even like I don't remember anything but all I know is I went straight to bed because I was so tired coming apparently it's time to go because Allison needs to get to school earlier to do something but I have my tryouts tonight and before my tryouts I need to go do something but I'll explain all that to you guys later because I have no time because we gotta go I'll see you guys after school hey guys I just got back from school I already changed so I'm ready for tryouts and I just finished eating lunch. But today, before my tryouts, I'm going to Alexis's house because she broke her elbow. It was like really bad. She had to get surgery and stuff for it. So I'm going to go to like Publix or something and get her some flowers and some of her favorite snacks. And then I'm gonna go to her house to drop it off and talk to her for a bit and then go to tryouts. I have to leave the house at like 5.40. About my tests today, my exams, they were pretty easy. The Spanish one was pretty easy, except there were some like questions that I had to guess on because I had absolutely no idea. Cause it was stuff on like soccer and stuff, which yeah, we did notes on, but like, I don't remember doing that. But anyways. Other than that, it was pretty easy. And then I had my history one. I was so scared for that one. But she went over everything that was going to like be on it. Like briefly, she went over it right before the test. So then when we took it, it was like actually pretty easy. Well, it felt easy. But whenever her tests feel easy, like I end up like failing. So who knows how, how I did on that. But it felt easy. So that was good. Now I'm going to edit for a bit because I'm almost done with my video. Oh. Check in with you guys later. Okay guys, it is now 5.41 and we're leaving the house because we gotta stop by Publix to pick up the stuff. We made it to Publix. I'm about to go in and get all the stuff and I'll give you guys a haul after. First got her some flowers. We got these pink roses, super cute. And then I got her a couple treats. I got her favorite snacks. Nerds gummy clusters, her favorite chocolate, which is these dark chocolate raspberry chocolates, some goldfish, and then I got her this little stuffed animal, and it's a pickle. So I got her that. And then for what we got, I got some true fruit, and I got this granola, protein granola. This is literally the best granola ever. I love it so much, and we ran out, so. And then we got two boxes of these protein bars. I've been loving these lately. They're chocolate salted caramel. And then lastly, some grapes. This is actually really heavy. These are the good grapes, like big, juicy green grapes. But now we're heading over to Alexis's house. We should be getting there around 634, which is right on time, so that I can hang out with her for a bit, and then I have to leave for my tryouts at seven. Okay, I'm at Alexis's house, and I'm gonna go talk to her for a bit. So I'll see you guys after. Hey guys, I'm back home from tryouts. Oh, I forgot I didn't talk to you guys after Alexis's house. It was fun. I hung out with her for a bit and she loved all the stuff that I got her. And then we went to tryouts. Tryouts went okay. We tumbled a little bit at first. My tumbling wasn't horrible, but it wasn't like great either. Like it could have been better. And then we stunted the rest of the time and they had me base. So that was fun, but I'm exhausted and I need to shower. Cause we got school again tomorrow. We got two more days, guys, two more days. Just gotta push through. Tomorrow my exams are math and vet. My vet one, that's actually an exam, which I actually haven't really studied for. She gave us an 100 question review. I did it two times, cause I had to for a grade. But I'm gonna shower and go to bed and I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Okay, good morning guys. I'm getting ready for school and I'm all dressed, but I think I'm gonna do a slick back in my hair today because it's kind of a mess from tryouts. But I don't know if I'm gonna do a ponytail or a braid. But I'm getting picked up early today to go get my nails done, which they really need to get done because 
very bad. I don't have to carry anything at school today, luckily. I think I'm gonna do a braid because my hair is way too poofy right now. And today's Katie's birthday. So tonight we're going out to dinner. We're going to Texas Roadhouse, which I'm excited for that because Texas Roadhouse bread, so good. Okay, here's the finished hair. Here's the fit for today though. We got the usual, big burks, blue leggings, and this shirt is from Hollister, I'm pretty sure. But my exams today shouldn't be too hard except for my vet one. Um, I'm a little nervous for that one, but let's hope it goes good. I actually find out what I get on that one right away because it's like online. So I'll know what I get after school. But I'll see you guys later when I'm on the way to get my nails done, which I'm looking for some transitions to do. I have one, but I want to find another transition to do. I just got picked up and now it's time to go get my nails done. I have my design. I'm not gonna show you guys yet. You guys will have to stay and wait until they're done. But school wasn't horrible today. The kite flying in my second period, it was it was interesting. Like like nobody's kite actually like flew. It was really bad, but it was funny. And then in fifth period I got an 84 on my exam. But that's okay. I had I ended with a 96 in the class, which is good. Then I was just sitting on my phone playing Papa's Cheeseria because I was making grilled cheese. But now I'm about to do my little nail transitions. I didn't actually find a second one. I only have one, but I'm gonna look for another transition. Guys, we just finished getting our nails done. Here are how mine look. Super cute and summery. It's five o'clock now. And we have to be at dinner for Kaylee's birthday at 6.30. So yeah, once we get home, it's straight to showering and getting ready. I have an idea of what I want to wear, but like, it's not for sure yet. Cause I, like, I don't know if it looks good. But anyways, while she was getting her nails done, I took a nap. I was tired. Yeah. But it was a pretty good nap, but yeah, rate the nails out of 10. Don't mind the like crusties around it. That's what happens when you get your nails done. It'll go away in like a day, so it's fine. But I'll see you guys when I'm getting ready. I wanna keep my hair in a slick back and a little braid because I feel like it's cute and also I don't really feel like doing my hair and I don't have time to like wash it and do it or anything. But my visions are pack some low rise jeans, light washed with then this tube top from, where is it, Airy. I'm gonna do a little bit more makeup than I usually do, cause I wanna look nice, I wanna get pretty. I love getting dressed up and like doing my hair and makeup every once in a while, but also not so much, cause I like just being comfy. Guys, I took this blush from my mom. It's actually so good. She Glam, it feels really weird putting it on cause it's like this type of applicator, but it's like really good. I might have put a little bit too much on, but that's okay. Okay, now we're gonna put on some bracelets. Okay, I feel like my outfit's complete. Wait, I should put on this necklace. This necklace is cute. We have this one. It has little, like, pearls on it. Oh, gosh, guys, my toes are not done. They're bright blue. Hello. Don't look at that. My mommy's gonna repaint them tomorrow. She's gonna paint them white for vacation. Okay, here it is. Rate it out of 10, even though... Comments are probably off. Low 360. Let's do a little model walk. That's what we think. Oh, I should probably not keep this hair tie on my wrist because that is not cute. But now that I'm dressed all cute, I'm gonna make some TikToks, of course. Hey guys, we made it to dinner. I'm starving. Here's everybody. And I'm about to dive into this bread. It's so good. It's, it is hot. I think I'm gonna get mac and cheese for like my actual dinner, but I'm about to eat like 10 rolls. Okay guys, I'm on roll number two. I'm guessing I'm gonna have four rolls. That's it, boy? I'm on roll number oh, three. I'm so guessing good. I'm gonna have 18 rolls. I'm tapping out at three and a half. No, you had four. I had three and a half. I had three and a half. Five had three and a half. But we just ordered dinner. Oh, we got more bread. Um, I might not stop at three and a half. Okay, yeah, I lied. I'm already on my next roll. But now we're stopping because I'm getting full. Okay, guys, my food is here. Time to taste test. Their fries are so good, actually. Cheers. One up a three. Is that gas? Okay, guys, we're going to do the thing where you let out all your air and then scream. 
Like, no way, that was so bad. <laughs> There's no way. No. That was terrible. That was terrible. Uh, <laughs> 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 oh, my God. <laughs> Walking over to Menchie's because there's Menchie's right across the street. I'm so excited. I love Menchie's so especially with like the trend and like it's all over our, our my for you page. And now I've been like craving Froyo. Oh, yeah. Okay, wait, let's Okay, we're crossing the street. It's not gonna run away. <laughs> Bro, I've actually eaten so much. I am so full, but always have room for dessert. What the? <laughs> it's literally like spoiled milk, it's but I love it. <laughs> you know what it tastes like? That yogurt that you can dump that. Oh my gosh, water. it gets worse. I love I it. This one? Yeah, I got dulce so de leche good. with like che cheesecake pieces. <laughs> oh, that's good. I'm so oh, so I got Original pig powder, parts? dulce de leche, cheesecake pieces, graham crackers, and caramel. Okay, guys, we're back home. I just changed. I'm actually so full. I don't think I've ever been this full before. I was thinking about packing today, but that's definitely not happening. I think I'm just gonna pack tomorrow. Exams that I have tomorrow are English and then AVID, which AVID literally isn't even an exam. We're literally just sitting in there and doing nothing. But guys, I checked the weather for like the UV in Punta Cana, which is where we're going. And I checked the UV here for next week. It's literally gonna be 11, like all week. And then in Punta Cana, it's literally gonna be like raining the first three days. The UV is gonna be like six the whole time. I'm like, what? But I feel like whenever you feel like you're not tanning or like getting burnt, that's when you get the most tan or burnt. While we were eating Menchies, I actually ran into some girls from my cheer team. Well, from my old cheer team. So sad. I feel like this week hasn't really felt like a finals week because I haven't really even done any like studying or anything. All my like exams that I had, I didn't really need to study for. But I'm gonna head to bed. Well, at least lay in bed. I probably won't go to sleep for a bit. But I'll see you guys tomorrow for the last day of school. Guys, I'm all ready for school. I had my chapstick in my lanyard and I literally left my lanyard in the car yesterday while I was getting my nails done and the chapstick literally melted and I had to throw it away, which is really sad. I really liked that chapstick. I got my notes to leave. Guys, the amount of absences or times I've left early this year is actually insane. Guys, I just got picked up. I'm officially not a freshman anymore. I'm basically a sophomore and I'm so happy. This day went by actually like pretty slow. Amen. Especially my first period. Oh my gosh. I finished my exam with like an hour left in the class and I was just sitting there like oh my gosh And we couldn't get our phones until everybody was done with the exam. Well my English exam It was really easy. I think I did pretty good on it and then for avid we played jeopardy and my team lost But it's fine and then we moved chairs out of all the classrooms <laughs> now We're heading over to the mall because my mom has to make some returns, but we're also stopping at CVS because we have to get some stuff here Haul time. We got lots of coupons, so we got a bit of stuff. But what I went in for was this CeraVe retinol serum because I have something on my forehead. I have all the little bumps, so I'm trying to get rid of it. And apparently TikTok said this is good for it. But we're just going to test it out. And then my mom got some telescopic mascara. She got the waterproof and then the black one. And then she got cinnamon gum because she that. wanted it. Yes. And then we had coupons for like certain sunscreens. And we need some for the vacations we're coming up, so we got two. We got tanning ones, of course. So we got this protective tanning spray and then this tanning oil. So now we're heading over to the mall. First stop is Aerie, and I got some bathing suits and these shorts. I can't really tell if I like them. I kind of do. But like at the same time, I don't know. Let's see what my mom thinks. Of course. I don't need it, Amy. They're 40% off, so she's like, you need to get more. Like, get every color. I'm like, I don't want them, though. I think, actually, I kind of like it. I think I'm going to get it. Okay, guys, I have this top on. I really like it, and it fits really good. But that one was too big on me, so that's a no. But I really like this one. I feel like my mom's going to like this one. What do you think? Oh, yes. I like it. It's cute. There's no, like, matching bottoms for it, but I'll just wear, like, white bottoms, so it's fine. Guys, now I'm American Eagle, and I have this little dress to try on. 
I didn't feel like taking my bra off, so ignore that. But it's a no. It's just not flattering. Okay, guys, I'm back home from the mall, and I'm going to give you guys a haul of everything that I got. So first from CVS, we had... Oh, I already showed you what I got from CVS. And then at Sephora, I got this Kosas sunscreen, but it's also like tinted because that's what I've been wanting because my body gets pretty tan, but then my face doesn't get that tan. So I've been wanting like a tinted moisturizer or sunscreen. The packaging is also really cute. And then I got the bathing suit top that I tried on in Aerie and also the shorts. I'm really tired. I don't know why I've been so tired lately. Like I took a nap yesterday and I also went to bed at like 10.30 last night. I woke up at seven today and then I'm just really tired. I kinda don't feel like packing. I might pack later tonight if I'm like bored tonight and can't fall asleep. I think I'll start packing tonight and like finish packing tomorrow. I think this is gonna be the end of the video. That's what my last week of school looked like. Okay, before I end the video, I have most of my exam results back. So I'm gonna tell you guys what I got. I think I did pretty good for my English exam. I got a 91. Math scores aren't in yet, but I'm pretty sure it's 100 because it was just like a participation grade for flying the kites. So that's most likely 100. I got a 91 in Spanish. I got an 84 in my vet one, which isn't the best, but to be fair, I didn't really study for it. And then on my history one, I got an 82, which for me, that's good. An 82 for me, is like an A because I struggle in that class. I got an 82 and that's a win for me. That's a win in my books. And my biology teacher hasn't created my final project. I'm really hoping I did good on that though, but who knows when she'll grade it. It didn't really feel like a last week because it was just like exams and I didn't really do much for the exams. I kind of just took them hoping for the best. But school is officially over. I'm basically a sophomore now. I'm no longer a freshman. I'm so glad like school i really did not like it this year it was not the best year but hopefully next year's better and it's officially summer which means vacations and sleeping in and not doing anything hanging out with your friends every day and i'm so excited but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out